All across the world, buildings that once stood tall with meaning and purpose now stand abandoned. Each has its own reasons for why it was abandoned, but Kings Park Psychiatric Center was abandoned in 1996 due to the simple fact that mental hospitals just weren't as necessary anymore, and the cost to keep it running didn't make sense. So after 111 years, Kings Park closed. All the patients were either cleared fit to leave or moved to a different center. Kings Park was a self-sustaining institution. Being located on Long Island and first opening its doors in 1890, KPPC helped form Long Island into the place that it is today. Kings Park has been left to decay for about 20 years now, with most of its over 100 buildings still standing, but some have been torn down. Still standing, tall and proud, are the massive buildings 7 and 93. Building 93 is a massive 13-story building that was finished in 1933 and is the most popular building of the center. With people traveling from all over to see it. Building 7 was one of the newer buildings built in the center. Finishing in 1966, its famous cube can be seen from all over the town of Kings Park. Buildings 41, 42, and 43 form the quads. The buildings that make up the quads are all connected and used to house patients. The format of these buildings, as odd as they look, were extremely common among psych centers across the world. Kings Park had its own firehouse, theater, and even a water tower. Kings Park often gets a rep for being haunted since the known fact that lobotomies and electroshock therapy was performed on the patient. The fact that it has a potter's field, a field that is a mass grave of unnamed bodies doesn't help when it comes to the spooky rumors about this place. Kings Park is a huge part of the history of Long Island, and even though it's abandoned, it still stands as a reminder of what it once was and the role it played in history.